Hey there friends, I have found the most amazing zombie mod for Minecraft and I have been building a zombie base to protect myself from the apocalypse. It has been some of the most fun I have had on Minecraft and today we're gonna finish the base. Luckily, we've got a pretty good base to start from. Wait, there's still more out here? Why haven't you all killed yourselves yet? All right, drawbridge being lowered. This was my uh, failed experiment at trying to crush the zombies because I want the rotten flesh to trade with a nearby village. But thanks to the comment section in the last video, I have an idea. Yep, that's right, I've stolen it. It is no longer yours, sorry. Oh my God, all the sheep here. There's never this many sheep here. Do I have anything to like draw them in? Because I was just gonna complain about food, but um, that might not be an issue anymore. I mean, friends is what I was complaining about, not food. Aha, wheat. Okay, everyone, let's put the we in wheat. All right, I suppose there's a H in there, so let's put the we in wheat. Group together, yep, form a nice orderly group. This one does not care. He sees something better on the horizon. I'm not sure what it is. No, don't go near the crops. Come over here. I want to build you your own little house. Oh my god, I think he's actually outsmarted me. He's realized that maybe this guy is never actually going to feed me. Oh, no, no, they're stupid. Don't worry. Come on in. Yep, there we go. Now just love each other for a second. <laughs> yes! Prisoners! Well, actually, the real prisoners are the friends we made along the way. <laughs> They've just been down here for a while now, but it's honestly much easier to just leave them here than bring them up. Unless... Oh, he might be onto something. I love how my chair here is just pointed at them. This dark room full of sheep. <laughs> There's a sheep already up here. Yeah, I think that's a baby that I locked up here and he must have grew up in this little hole. Gravel? Where did I use gravel? Oh, oh yeah, in the tower. Come on everyone, freedom. No? All right, come on everyone, wheat, wheat, come on. <laughs> there we go, yeah, that works. <laughs> That's a motivator. There we go. Like, I know as an Irishman, I should be able to live off these potatoes, and I could, but, you know, aesthetically, it's nice to have, like, an animal pen. Come on in, boys, the lava's fine. I guess I'll just wait until morning. Oh, oh, oh. All right. <laughs> Even wheat wouldn't bring that sheep over. He came up solely to kill himself. I mean, everyone's doing it. Come on, buddy. You can still make it in. What the? Where did you come in from? We've got a leak. <laughs> Zombies are getting in somewhere. It's probably these tunnels that I made. I'm also going to do something that I just never do, and that's create carpet so I can jump the fence. People think I just don't know it, but they don't realize my personality is incompatible with being efficient. I'd rather just struggle every time I do it rather than putting in the effort once so apparently this makes it so i can jump in. you were all wrong i hate every one of you <laughs> no i'm kidding i'm kidding come back ah oh, that's what you meant okay i yeah love you guys thanks <laughs> out of the way you nudist oh no i like how it looks but i don't actually oh <laughs> hello mr clothes on gimme get out of here you nudist <laughs> they're like dude you keep stealing our clothes stop shaming us for it yeah that looks cool i <laughs> like the the wall not the naked sheep cowering in the corner and it's almost morning i'm excited we gotta finish the crusher <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's why I have that there. That's Kevin proofed. <laughs> I need to move that lava around to the sides to, like, fix the moat. I've been... I kept meaning to fix this myself, but it's just such a daunting task. But I'll do it this time. I promise. Soon. Just not now. <laughs> <laughs> Rather than testing on a zombie, does a piston suffocate you? I tested it on myself. I just walked onto it and like, hmm, I wonder will I die? Okay, so the pistons need a block to crush them. Confirmed. I wonder though, what if I release lava with a piston and then it would close again, shutting off the lava and they burn to death? Because I think right now the reason I'm losing their drops is because, well, it just burns up in the lava. Only one way to test this. <laughs> oh, I love experimenting. I'm something of a scientist myself. You know, oh wait, it's raining. Oh god damn it. I'm not a very good scientist. Okay. I never claimed that much I <laughs> just let them get a, a whiff of my cologne meat for men. I'm really trying to make this a thing Would you buy it if I made it? Let me know in the comments. Okay. Good morning sheep Um, I only have one wheat so I can only feed one of you. Okay now I hold on now one of you one All right, you're, you know what if you're all greedy none of you get to eat. Oh, I'd make such a good parent <laughs> Can't wait for fatherhood. All right, let's get exploring. I need to get rid of the side entrance one, because it's ugly, and
and two, I keep using it just because it seems a little bit safer than this one right now. Maybe the answer is to fix this rather than be like, let me force myself to use a dangerous <laughs> and unreliable system. But again, that's a lot of effort, you know? Rather just spray on some meat for men and hit the town. I love my explorer hat that I got from that prisoner last time. Oh my god, a hat! Okay, I need that hat really badly. And we need to find a swamp if we can to try and get slime. Do I have 42 baked potatoes on me? I do. Again, standard Irish thing. I think for most people, you go phone, keys, wallet, or equivalent. But for an Irish person, it's phone, keys, wallet, 42 potatoes. Yep, I'm good. <gasps> Arrival village, eh? <laughs> the sword immediately comes out. It's muscle memory. What you got in here? <laughs> Wait, there's no even door here. Wait. Are they in this mountain? Oh my god, what the, what the hell? Oh, you want rotten flesh too? Well, I'll just leave you in there then. Oh, nice door. I like that. Very antisocial. This one doesn't have a door either, even though it, it has the space for it. Oh, because it should be there, I guess? Yeah, anyway. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. Nine leather. No, I just want rotten flesh, really. It's more fun. And the ninja wants coal. That I can't give you. You know, I think I've been to this village before. I think I've already tormented them a bit. It's hard when you torment so many villages to remember what you've done to each. I could go any direction. Why am I forcing myself to go the hardest direction possible? I just thought this looked more swampy than, you know, where I was last looking, which was a literal desert, <laughs> and I need a swamp. Oh, the blood moon is rising already and the the only swamp he got was swamp ass i've been running for miles okay well i found a swamp and this loser zombie who didn't get the update on the fashion trend what the hell was that all right sorry about the fashion jokes but no one is dressed like that anymore what the hell is this i'm so glad there's water because he seems impossibly fast unfortunately no slimes i'm worried they only spawn in dark areas and they probably won't spawn because all the spawns are zombies, essentially. So I might be out of luck. The only way might be using normal pistons. But it is all good because I'm going to gather some other stuff while I'm here. Hey, piggy. I'm gathering you. <laughs> the poor piggies. No, don't go down there. Ah, oh, he died anyway. I heard the llama spitting and I was looking into this cave. It's like, if you spit me off there, I'm gonna kill you and your entire family. This swamp is absolutely massive, but absolutely empty as well, unfortunately. I haven't seen anything spawn other than that crazy zombie. I might try making a temporary shelter for tonight. It's not too far from the house, um, but I might make a little shelter and just hide out there and see if any slime spawn. So let me get somewhere central. Yes, look at this, our first castle outpost. It's actually just kind of a treehouse, though, <laughs> just to be totally honest with you. It's not that impressive, but it's kind of cool. Although it does feel like the Drake and Josh episode where I forgot to make a door because, well, I don't want the zombies coming in. It's kind of neat, though. I actually like this little design, the mix of the two colors. It's simple. <laughs> something spawned or was it a cow <laughs> it could have been a cow <laughs> pretty terrified right now i should probably light up my little area although i'm not sure if this is a beacon for like are you hungry <laughs> come here <laughs> i'm a meal god my neighbors must be really confused <laughs> who i am as a person is that a slime is that <laughs> <laughs> i was so close to my monitor right now I, oh, there's a slime over there. What am I saying? Oh my god, it's so hard to see though. Okay, the sun is rising and um, there are a lot of slimes. Like a lot, a lot. But the issue is the zombies don't despawn now, do they? So I got to kill them all to get to the slimes. That's not an issue. Because just like only we can prevent forest fires, we can feckin' start them too. <laughs> Here we go. I hear them dying. All right, I'm just gonna put that there. Kevin proof it. And now I just wait in my little castle. Okay, I think it's done <laughs> okay judging by that zombie arm just jumping up and down i think we're kind of done let me just whoo, parkour my way over oh there's still a few left how is the tree not up in flames there we go and here are the slimes i'm looking for ow i what the hell i thought they were passive good luck for being passive now you feckers <laughs> i just killed like multiple generations of a family because he hit me aha there you are i love fighting in water <laughs> seems like i have the advantage and boy do i love an unfair fight okay it's getting a uh, a little bit dark and um, that's a tiny bit concerning but i'm nearly home so i'm sure it'll be fine don't worry about little old me
me. Please worry a lot. Pray for me. One like, one prayer. Oh my god, I, I can't even actually see. I hope I'm going the right direction. Oh, thank you for your prayers, everyone. I think we're okay. Woo! All right, okay, I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this? If you haven't watched the other ones, it's my little secret entrance. It goes to my house from the forest. Don't you dare tell anyone. You hear me? I know where you live because I live right over there. That's right, and there's nothing you can do about it. it ah, fecker! Like, not only the physical damage, but the emotional damage there of making me look like an idiot. But at least my tunnel wasn't idiotic, because honestly, it, it felt like maybe it was, but now I can see that it all paid off. And look at all that slime I have to play with. I'll get my revenge for them making me look like an idiot. I'll get them back. Oh, the wheat is ready. Excellent. You know the old saying, when there's wheat, eat and breed. Yeah, I think that's that's the end of the saying. When there's wheat, eat and breed. All right, zombie crushing time. Oh, they're all complaining. All right, just keep using that for now. I know you must be getting bored of it, but I'll have a different way to kill you soon. Much more profitable way, I might add. I like how a literal thunderstorm has started. It's making it out like I'm the bad guy. Okay, so I've gotten all the sticky pistons, and now I guess I will put blocks on them. It just feels like a big step, you know? Feels dangerous, and that thunderstorm is still going. Okay, I'm gonna need some of the redstone that I buried earlier in my in my failed attempt to make this work. Yes! Oh my god, that looks so cool! Wait, did it destroy itself when I used it? Redstone fell down. Yes, it did. God damn it! I made a machine that kills itself. Aha! Okay, I, I think it's all right now. <laughs> okay, here we go. Doors open, boys. Come on in. <laughs> oh no. They've outsmarted me again. I love how I chastised my creation earlier for killing itself, but the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. I just jump off the wall when I want to come down. Okay, I think this is a pretty easy fix. I think I just need to put in fences instead of walls so they'll think they can actually get to me. Blood moon is rising, which means it's testing time. I also blocked off this because this thing is just too effective. <laughs> I need it to be blocked so that they all come in here and get crushed. We have two volunteers so far. Where's the horde? Ah, here they are. Okay, let me jump down. Ah, I'm weak and defenseless. Owie. Ah. <laughs> oh, it's working. For once, it pays off to look pathetic. <laughs> All right, let's give this a go. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. I think I'll swap it to a switch so it can just be turned on and off. Okay, boom. Yes! I'm clapping my own creation. I'd like to think that's what God does about me. Okay, they're dead. Now to check, can I actually collect the rotten flesh? Oh my God, I believe I can. 24, yes! Okay, I got my chair. Excellent. <laughs> oh, what a great time to be alive and not dead like them. In fact, it's a terrible time to be dead. All right, the crusher is complete. I'm gonna be rich, I tells you, rich. Oh, they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. I love it. So now they have their choice. You can burn to death or you can be crushed to death, one or the other. It's quite handy though, because if I want them to empty out, if I stand here, they tend to go around. So then I can just block this off and go in and get whatever I need. I tell you, when you're good, you're good. And I am good. Look at that, 51 rotten flesh. That'll make me a millionaire. There we go, and I added a little mine onto my house. That looks pretty neat. So now instead of just a little passage, we have a cool little mine entrance there. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, it's becoming a new day, and you know what? I'm gonna stop procrastinating, and I'm gonna fix this moat, and I'm gonna get rid of this bridge. Lucky for you, you don't have to watch. I'll see you in a while. Okay. Okay, so the moat is finally complete and I definitely didn't use creative mode. Okay, maybe I swapped to creative, okay? But this was super tedious and it would just require me to run up and down the stairs a lot and I don't like even going up the stairs once. But look at this, we have our little entrance over the lava and we've still got the crusher up in action. I also made this room, um, I don't know what it is yet. <laughs> it's just kind of a room. I mean, it's safe. There's lava. Well, it's not safe at all, actually, because of the lava. But, uh, yeah, it's here. And hopefully it won't kill me. The thing is, I could technically take down all of these fences now, but I don't think I trust myself. I think that's the problem. I end up just wandering off into the lava by accident. I'm gonna get rid of those blocks, put down some mossy cobble, and plant some vines on the side. That'll make it look cool when they grow down. The one thing this is missing 
is entertainment. It has everything else. Well, this is kind of entertaining, but that's not enough for my growing mind. Like we have a farm, we have a home, we have a mine, we have prisoner sheep. I need something for entertainment. He <gasps> I could make a TV. <laughs> oh, that would keep me going in the zombie apocalypse. So I guess this area can actually be like the entertainment room. Like you've got the TV and you've got the live action. There we go. I made an awful birch coffee table. It looks like a cow print or something. <laughs> okay, turn Turns out I can't play my own videos, so oh, I can't play my own GIFs either. They're too big. Okay, this is it. This is the only channel I have. This is the only GIF I could get to actually work. So this is all, all, all I have. I have three channels. I don't have anything on the other two channels. So really, I only have one channel. This is my entertainment. This is much better, honestly. I love the crusher. It is kind of cool seeing it over there, though, I must admit. And plus, because it's a green screen, we can do wacky stuff like this. What? <laughs> That's really coming together. Okay, and I want to install some wired fences around the place, I think. Just- Ow! Ow! It wasn't Kevin proofed. There we go. Now hopefully they'll just bump into those on their travels. I know I did. Okay, good. They seem to just bump into them. They don't really try and avoid it. That's great. I look like a gardener. <laughs> Maybe I should have, like, my armor ready to go here at the entrance. There we go. I don't need that helmet because well i have my hat and that's all i need oh some of them can see uh, <laughs> some of them can see sands from the from the <laughs> This is just such a weird scene. You can see the zombies off in the right just walking in. Sans is on the Minecraft TV with the sheep looking onward. I like this area though. It's really, really nice now. It feels safe. I'm gonna use some of those iron bars up here so it looks like I have a functional door, even though I do not. I like to keep the illusion <laughs> that I know what I'm doing. All right, everyone, give me your wool. I need a couch. And your reward? Some of you may eat. Oh God, that got their attention. Breed, breed, my pretties. I really really need you to because I'm running out of potatoes. I've eaten a lot. There we go. Reminds me of my childhood when we used to gather around the table and watch Sands as a family. Ah, oh, and some crates to really get that warehousey, crafty, weird, castle-y vibes. <laughs> Just trying to dress up the place. Okay, give me a break. Oh, I can make a painting. That's a great way of dressing up the place. Something big for a castle. Oh, okay, too big. <laughs> or at least not in the right spot. I guess in the entertainment lounge. Oh my god, why are they huge? Why am I getting what I asked for for a change? I don't understand. Okay, there we go, that's something. There we go, I Kevin proofed that little window, you know, I still get to look out, but I can't fall out, luckily. Okay, and this is not a job for me. This this is un-Kevin proofing something. This is Kevin unproofing. It should never be carried out by me, but I'm going to, because I want the place to look nice. I really like these stone paths in this uh, little mod pack. They're really nice. I like how it's a zombie apocalypse mod, and I'm like, oh, I really love the stone paths. They're so quirky. I just think they're neat. There we go. That is lovely. I am really happy with how this all turned out. I feel like I've made a nice little base that's very defended. It's sustainable. It's even got a hidden entrance in the woods. Not to mention the entertainment lounge. And I could honestly see myself settling down and surviving the apocalypse here. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new. And I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.